yeah, the stuff that goes on behind the scene. I just told my husband, I see why people want to get paid for doing videos. Because I'm talking about some people. But anyway, I hope you guys are doing well. This is my sixth time doing it, the seventh time doing it. I don't even know the count. Over and over, just time consuming. The only good part about me, I'm not editing no videos. I probably get back into that. We'll see. Because I want to record. My husband, he's so smart. I want to record some of the things that he does. But I'm going to get a new channel. Anyway, another channel. Another channel. Um, I'm doing well. I hope you guys are, are doing well also. I am talking about the 90 day no meat challenge. Yay! I ain't celebrating because it ain't 90 days yet. But anyway, I, I that's, that's just to get me, get my mind back. Like, girl, where you going? You Do you know where this meat came from? You popping all up in your mouth. Well, got, yeah, they, yeah, yeah, about the company, yeah, mm-hmm. Yeah, it tastes good and it's organic, they say. What the word organic mean, y'all go check that out. But anyway, um, I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. Have I had a relapse? Have I wanted to bite on some meat? No, I haven't. But I, I've um, gotten a, another order from a meat company. I think I mentioned that. Yeah, matter of fact, I think I got the day uh, day two. Excuse me. And he had all these. I had ordered all this meat for my husband, and actually, I was included on that list because I ordered some stuff that I wanted to try. Also, but guess what? I'm not being a part of that. No, I'm not. Um, yeah, I, I I love how I feel when I don't eat meat. My my digestion system. Is amazing, you know. You guys who are constipated, and just because you go to the bathroom every day does not mean you're not constipated, okay? There's a, I got a new thing I'm saying, TL, too late when I say something, okay? Because I don't say it, it's too late for you to get the TMI, okay? That's, I don't want to start it first, so if y'all hear it, it came from me. Yeah, I looked over at the camera this time. But um, yeah, I don't even know what I was just saying. But I'm I'm move right on. <laughs> I am feeling well. I've been working out, and I think that's another reason. In the evenings, like in the afternoon, noon time, I really it's like I'm tired, and I have to program myself that you going to work out. Like I really want to work out this evening. Even if I just work on weights. And one thing I want to share with you guys. I've been sitting my butt on the floor. Not fell down on the floor. And you know you got down on the floor by accident. But I actually sat on the floor. But it was. And this was about two weeks ago now. But I think it was about two weeks. Almost two weeks. Um. And I was like, I saw Abby, Abby was down there kitten in it. I'm like, oh, I, that's what I want to do. I want, I want to get down on the floor. And I'm like, Abby, how you get down? <laughs> yeah, y'all, it's time to laugh. I say, I say, how, how you get down? I'm gonna get down there. I know how to get on the floor, but I just, my mind just couldn't wrap around me bending my legs and I'm getting that. I know, y'all. I know. T L. It's too late. Okay, anyway, I was trying to find a picture of me. I don't know if I, ha I think I have one. Uh, of me actually sitting down on the floor. If I don't show y'all me, I'll show y'all Adriana. She was sitting in front of me. She was working out. I don't know that I delete those pictures. Cause, oh, gosh. I don't like the pictures. At all, y'all. Oh my gosh. It's like, really? That's you? But here, I'm going to put myself out there. Bam! But anyway, that's me sitting on the floor working out. Yeah, don't you see them arms? My arms has a lot of loose, loose um, skin. Um, and it's because I was that big. My arms has gone down. 
My my arms is not even as big as this. It's big. It's still big. I'm not saying, oh gosh, I lost ten inches. No, actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna I am going to measure myself today because I want to see the difference from me lifting weights, doing a, a lot of weights. I know I'm supposed to be talking about me eating meat. I think I've pretty much finished that. Um, I'm doing well on on that on that, but I'm also adding me getting on the floor doing weights. I've been doing some great workouts on the floor. Um, it's been amazing. It's been amazing. It's been amazing. It's been amazing. Um, I'm I'm at the weight. I'm almost at the weight that I was before I got pregnant with Ebony. I, I said that, and I'm 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 not too far from it. <sighs> not too far from it. That shows. <clears throat> And uh, let me go back. Um, I won't even talk about. It. <coughs> oh, excuse me. <clears throat> um, I'm almost at the weight I was um, before I got pregnant with Ebony. Um, I still have about. I it's so crazy how the scale thing is, um, but I believe I might have. I don't know, probably ten to. 15 pounds to go. I'm not even sure because my skin is crazy. It's crazy. I don't do the scale thing like that because I can go like I said. Go on the day is 5 pounds more and then go back to Morris the whole nother song. You know, and I'm like, whoa! 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 And you know what that has to do with? What time you weighed yourself? How much you water you drunk? And how much did you move your meat okay um and one thing i have not done in the last couple of days is drink a lot of water so yeah i know if i go on there right now it's gonna tell me i'm probably a pound or two heavier than i really am so that's why i don't i gave y'all big numbers because you know i like to keep it safe okay um so that's why i say like with my weight you know it's like a iffy where i am so what i do i measure myself and i the last time i measured myself i had lost over 20 some inches i forgot i think i did a video about it so that that's what i go by if i see that's moving then i know i'm doing something right okay um and i see my cl <clears throat> my clothes um i still even be wearing them they be big like like this shirt that i have on now it looks you know tight all up here actually it's kind of sinking in or <laughs> whatever but it was uh, a little more up you know what i'm saying so it's kind of you see i don't know y'all probably think like what are you talking about but anyway my shirt is much looser on the bottom the bottom you know it's much looser all over <clears throat> but i still wear my clothes um even if they're like like they about to fall off me and stuff, I still wear them. Um, but I do also add more clothing because if I like like I like this shirt is nice and cool. It has you know the sleeves is pretty long. Y'all see them arms? I could I can't believe I cannot believe how big I had got. Like how did that happen? I know how it happened, okay? Too late. <laughs> I, I I know. I put food in my mouth. Uh, like, where was my mind? Like, what was I thinking? And I, I did gain. Oh, my gosh. I gained. I gained a lot over, over, over 100 pounds with uh Combined three pregnancies, 2009 and 10 and 11, okay? So, but I'm not, it's not, it's like before that, like before, before. Um, it, it's just amazing, it's amazing to me. Uh, I always been tall, I always was a tall, skinny girl in the class, you know. Um, and I remember my dad telling me, you're going to be bigger than me because we used to weight each other on the scale. I was daddy's girl, okay? 
Um, so, you know, and I remember him saying that to me, but, you know, I was rolling on like, no, I'm not. I'm not going to be, you know, I was almost there. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I remember we weighing, you know, I ain't going to go. I'll tell y'all my weight stuff later. I'm, oh, y'all, I'm going to shock y'all. Uh, may not shock none of y'all. Y'all probably already got an idea. I just want to get where I want to, where I need to be because I see a cycle of some people keep going around in circles. I'm not going there. That is not my story because I have lost over, I lost over 150 pounds. So I know I'm doing something right here. Okay. And it's not, it's not back on me. You know what I'm saying? My arms, this, this stuff you see hanging, that's how big my arm was. So. Oh my God, like look at all this. This is extra. I don't know if y'all can see. But this is, this. like my arm is up here. Like my arm. like. But the rest of this is just how big my arm used to be. See, my arm is here. <laughs> this is crazy. The rest of this is just from my arm being stretched. Okay? And I am working on that. This I'm really working on my arms. So if you guys know some tips to help me um, make sure I'm getting this thing done. Because I, I haven't lift weights. I mean, I did weights, but I'm really doing weights like I did in uh, back in the days. I, a lot of stuff happened in 2009. I did a lot of stuff in 2009. <laughs> my eyes was open to... Trust in the Father in 2000. Just so much. I can sit down and tell y'all uh, uh, hours of uh, video of 2009 that happened to me. Um, but anyway, um, what else? But anyway, I, I've, I've, I see where I've come from. But if this is your first time looking at my video, you'll say, wow. But no, you, you should have saw me. <clears throat> Let me see if I find a picture. Yeah, I am wild, but I'm not wild where I was. <laughs> okay? I have come a long ways. And it took for me to see pictures to see where I was. I, I, even my husband, like, that was you? Like, where we was? Like, where our minds were? Like, it's just all about getting the grind and, you know, grabbing you some fast food. Yeah. When um Ebony was like three, it was so bad. Let me show y'all when I was I just had Adriana. So you can see just the difference here. And in even in this picture here, I think Adriana maybe three months, two, three, somewhere in there. In this picture here, I had even gained a hundred more pounds with my my other pregnancy after Adriana sold. Yeah. The baby was eight pounds. So, you know. Well, let's give it 20 some pounds, maybe 26 with the uh, everything else pertaining to the baby. But check this out. Y'all probably saw this in the picture, my one of my videos. But yeah, you see how tight my skin is? That's because my skin was stretched. You see what I'm saying? That's fat. That's, that's fluids and fats and yeah. So... I'm going to let y'all look at it again because y'all might not see. Like, look at the face. My face today. and see my face here. But the, just imagine. Also, I was bigger. I was 100 pounds bigger than that. So, yeah. Pretty. That's some serious stuff, y'all. I'm trying to find. Y'all might have saw this picture. Here's another picture. I believe this is uh, me with the hundred pounds more. So here, here I am. Yeah, yeah. I want y'all to see that that girl there. Yeah. I don't. I don't know who she is. Like. Yeah. And these little sugar answers is just trying to have fun with my pictures. My my phone. Let me let y'all look at her again. I believe I, I might have, I don't know, I don't know who, what happened. During this time, uh, Adriana was going through a lot with her skin, and 
I wasn't even taking care of me. I was just, wasn't even mean. I was just like, whatever. It was rough. But um, one thing I, I worked hard to do with Ebony is to make sure she wasn't, she didn't, was no big person, chunky person. So anytime she wanted to eat something, I always gave her fruits, I mean vegetables, things of that nature. But after having Adriana and and um, a, a very strict diet, which we still have a strict diet. Actually, I, I, our diet has become even stricter. Like, we was concerned about what she was going to eat now. It's like, what we going to eat. Um, she ate a lot of rice. So I, I tell people, don't put the rice down and the sugar. Because this is what rice and sugar does. This is not even one of her, like, chunky pictures. Yeah, my baby. Um, so, let me show you her today. Just cutting that rice and sugar. Let me show y'all her today. For those who haven't seen any of my videos. I think my family and I are just chilling. Let me show y'all Miss Adriana today. I want to get a really good picture. Come on, where, where? I think this picture is pretty good. But look at her today. Actually, it's not her today, but you know what I'm saying. You can see her eyes and <laughs> she have a neck. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, wow. Yeah, that's what sugar. And she didn't eat a lot of sugar. Well, I guess she did eat a lot of sugar. But she would have little drinks. Um, didn't put much sugar, but yeah. I want to show y'all another picture. Right, I want y'all to see her face. <sighs> For you guys who just come in. Look her arms. She, you, you see what I'm saying? So, we came a long ways. And I'm, I'm just thankful and I'm conscious of what I'm doing. Okay? Um, I'm back and forth with the... the uh, the exercise, I did not intend my video to be this long. And I didn't intend to talk about what I'm talking about. I really didn't. But for whoever, whoever needs to be motivated and, and pushed to, to take care of themselves. You know, that's why I do videos. It's all about the love that I have for people, for real. And, and one thing I won't do is compromise. But I will share everything that I, I can share. I can not everything. I'm not sharing everything. I learned. I, I learned. I have learned. I had to learn that recently, not a couple months ago. I have to back up because yeah. But um anyway, um yeah, we gotta better ourselves and yeah. This oh let, let me say this. Let me just insert this. Because we got people who look at, oh, the, the lighting was off. No, it's about the content, what you got in your video. As long as I can hit that, I can hear it and all that, I'm good. I am. Um, I got it. But, um, yeah, we can do this, y'all. And the reason why, for those who think, because I still get people asking me, am I vegan? I am not vegan. No, I'm not telling people not to eat meat. My concern. It's going to come out anytime, anytime I pick up stuff, it always right. It is never, and it's not me, it's the most high. And I know it's him because it comes to pass. Everything that I, when I get like weary or something, or it's like a no, don't touch that, don't do that. Not that, you know. Then I, I, I learned to listen because I used to be like, no, it's probably me. No, that's probably not what it is. I had to go through a lot of stuff to learn that. I didn't have to, but I went through a lot of stuff to learn to listen. And I'm listening about the meat. Even though I got off for a couple of weeks. But I'm listening. 
and I'm obeying. We did not grow this meat. Uh, when I say grow, we didn't raise it. We didn't we didn't feed it. You know, those, those are my concern. What did they inject it with? You know, and uh, yes, we can pray over food. We know that. But um, unless and I know the person who raised it and I know the system and what they do. Now, these companies that I bought from, they're supposed to be really, 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 really like off the system thing. But I beg to differ. Some ain't right, like with one of them, because I was coughing like right after I ate some of the meat. So it's like, did y'all put corn here? Did y'all do something different here? So, anyway, and I'm not sure which one it was. So <clears throat> I can't I can't give you an answer to that. And I'm not going to eat no meat to find out. So. <sighs> um, the 90 day challenge and all my other ex, you know, I added things here to, to hopefully encourage someone, um, it's, 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 it's a journey and on this journey, you're going to fall, you just get back up, you know, you might eat something that you shouldn't have ate, you just stop eating it and people say, wait till Monday. No, because if you ate that on Tuesday, you're going to wait all the Monday. You're going to eat all that other crap you know you shouldn't eat. I always say start with your next meal. The next thing that you put in your mouth, you do better. You know what I'm saying? That's where I'm at. I don't know what's on that TV. I don't even think they can hear it. But anyway. um, I think that's about it. So thanks. I uh, thanks Odala. Let me see. Fine. Odalia. Thank you for joining me on this journey. And anybody else, y'all can come on in. It's day eleven, so we still got a whole bunch of whole bunch of more days left. <laughs> um, but anyway, and, and it's not too late. To today that you feel compelled to change your body, to change what you're doing, is that day to do it. Not the next day, because that not even the next breath is promised, but just changing what you're doing. I do feel well, I feel great, I feel awesome. Um, and that's what it's all about. I'm not me, a lot of people look at um, the size of a person. I don't look at I, I want to be healthy because you can be healthy. Uh, let me go back. You can be skinny, what people call fine and nice looking and all that, and be inside all messed up. So everybody got to take care of themselves. If you naturally got buff muscles and, you know, you got the curves and all that, cool, awesome. But we still got to take care of the inside. Like, you can't eat like what a person, and, and, and it's still dealing with metabolism and all that, how fast... The body is burning up the calories. And if you're not doing nothing, of course, it's not going to go anywhere. It's just going to turn into fat. Yeah. So the, the evidence is there. Um, this is what I want to say. Oh, my God. This is a long video. I know people don't skip through this video. That's when they miss everything. They probably, not everything, but they miss something. Um... For me, and this is what I want to really, maybe I need to do another video, but I'm going to put it on this. I want to say you can exercise your body all day long. This goes in what I was just saying as well. But if you're not eating right, it's just a waste of your time. I've done that before. Um, yeah, I was losing weight and all that, but still I was sick. You know, like mucus, you know, all those other things was going on inside of my body. My system was still off. Um, it's amazing how we just don't want to, this flesh just want to do what it want to do. I would say, first... If you really overweight, like if you're over 50 pounds overweight, 30 pounds over, I don't care how much, if it's, well, 5, 10 pounds, y'all straight. But if you 50 on up, 25 on up overweight, I would say to you, 
especially if you're over 100 pounds overweight, to first get your eating down. If you get your eating down, you're going to lose weight without even extra. I lost, I lost a lot of the weight I lost was just me changing my eating. Um, I did work out, but not as much as I'm doing today. Um, you know, I rode my bike, you know, made a, maybe rode my bike 10, 12 miles or whatever, burned a thousand calories or whatever. Um, but that's probably about all I did. And I might have did a little weights, but I'm doing all of that now. Plus, you know, I'm doing a whole, I'm spending an hour, 45 minutes. Um, sometimes we spend an hour, 30 minutes. Sometimes we just only look at the clock. We just work out because we love it. Like, I'm just the vibe we feel, you know, the energy. Um, but what I'm going to say to you, go back to what I was saying. Get your eating down. And I know, I know people looking at, wait a minute, how much weight you weigh, lady, and you trying to tell me about eating? I can do that. You know why? Because I've come here. I got this far. So I can help you if you have the issues that I had. And if you you overweight, you know what I'm saying? What they call old weight, because we don't supposed to be no 120 pounds people anyway. I mean, unless you short, and I'm not short, you know. <sighs> anyway, get your eating down, get your fruits in, and if you choose to eat meat, just be careful where your meat comes from. Let me, I need to stop, because my family is over there, these quiet as on or what. <laughs> um... And then get your work out in. You got to move your meat. You got to. You can't do that forever. Y'all cannot eat. Just eat healthy for the next year and expect your body. No, you gonna, your, flat, your fat going to be flat. And it's going to be that much harder for you to get it, you know, toned. Because that's one of my issues. So, it, it will. It, they go together. It goes together. But if you working out and you ain't eating right, you wasting your time. So I'm telling you, get your eating thing down. You get that down. If it takes you a year to get it, then you you know you do that. But just know you don't have to work hard with toning. Yep, I'm telling you my what I experienced. Uh, so just showed y'all these buff, this buff. Yeah, this this him. Yeah. yeah. Did y'all saw it in the picture? It was my arms was tight. Tight. Yeah, look at that. Do that look tight? It's not tight now. Look at that. This is hanging on. Look at that. I couldn't have grabbed this before. <laughs> I couldn't have grabbed this. I couldn't have grabbed this one hanging. It was tight. All fat. I had stretched my body like that. And I'm not proud of that at all. I'm making a joke out of it in a little way, but yeah, I could have died. Oh boy, I tell you, I don't know. I don't. I, I know. I do know. I'm not. I'm saying I don't know, but still, just to not see yourself. I didn't see myself. I didn't see myself like that. I didn't see myself until I looked in the mirror. Until I actually looked in the mirror, my mirror was a picture. My picture was a, a video of me being in labor with my last baby in 2011. I couldn't believe that was me. I couldn't believe that. I, I wish I can find that video. But I couldn't believe that was me. Yep. I did it. To me. Because I wasn't taking care of me. I, wasn't, I was busy taking care of everybody. Yeah. But now taking care of me 
And that's what you got to do. Take care of yourself. I've heard that before. Then you can help everybody else. So that's why I'm at y'all today. I got to take care of myself. And uh, my brain is running along with me though. Yeah. Because she's five. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I'm so proud of her. You know. I'm proud of what I'm talking about. Because taking away the rice and the sugar from my child. Even... Oh, recently I was, she was like, I want some pasta. And the pasta, her pasta was rice pasta. Can't do it. Brown rice, organic. Can't do it. Starch, sugar, all the same. Anyway, Thousand Rosie guys, thank you guys for stopping by. <sighs> Let's take care of ourselves. And we'll be better people and be able to do what we need to do and reach the places we need to reach and go where we need to go and do what we need to do and say what we have to say. Shalom to my Yashua family. A thousand rows, you guys. Thank you guys for staying here for 31 minutes.